Not only do the Fresno State Spirit members support multiple athletics on campus year round, they also host a huge fundraiser and compete across the country. Joining us today to talk about their season upcoming events is Annalise Rodriguez, fourth year dance member, captain and president. Also joining her is Serena Anderson, third year dance member, and Ashley Ramos and Megan Mayo. They are both third year cheer members. Welcome ladies. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so excited to have you guys here. I, season just kicked off. How is it starting? It's going well. We're <laughs> practicing three times a week, both cheer and dance. Yeah. And we're going to start workouts, I think, in two weeks. We're still doing little workouts here and there, but we're doing great as well as our practices are going. Well, how do the practices work and the workouts and everything? What do you guys do to get prepared? So for cheer, they practice Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. Mm -hmm. And then we have morning workouts at 6 in the morning one day a week really? and then a big team <laughs> practice on Fridays. Um, for dance we practice on Wednesdays, Thursdays and Fridays. Wow, yeah. busy, busy. Yeah. And you guys are going to be even busier in the coming months because you have Spirit Fest. Yes. Yes. Tell us a little bit about what goes on for that. Um, so for Spirit Fest, that is on Saturday, November 9th. It is our biggest fundraiser and it is for four to 15 year olds to come and cheer with us on the field at halftime. And the kids get to get a t-shirt and get a perform at halftime with us for $40. And then there is a online registration this yeah. year for that. That's something that's new this year. So I think that's going to um, widen the amount of people that were able to get there. So just mm -hmm. be sure to look Absolutely. out on social media for that. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. I, that's just incredible. I mean, what's the best part about having all these kids get to go on and perform with you guys? Um, a part of it, just knowing that you're a role model within our community and just knowing that they really look up to us and like, we love having them. They're just so much fun. And it's just so cool thinking that these could be future spirit members later on in the upcoming years saying like, they look up to us and like, that's what I want to do when I'm in college. I love that. Plus, it's probably so cute. I'm just imagining yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> so cute. Really cute. <laughs> well, on top of that, you guys also do competitions. I mean, yes. you go all the way to Florida at some point for this. Tell us a little bit about how that goes. Yeah, so we're starting our competition season off early. So this year we'll start learning our comp routines hopefully this month or next month. And then we can go and start competing in February. Usually we compete in Anaheim. Some years we go to Daytona. So Wow. We're really hoping to go back to Daytona soon. I know we went um, two years ago with cheer and that was just a lot of fun. Yeah, Being able to represent huge. the Valley and just everyone here. Wow. Well, with cheer and dance, how do the two kind of differ a little bit? Um, um, so cheerleading, we focus more on stunting and throwing people in the air and tumbling and then dance. I don't know if you guys want to explain that a little more. Um, dancing is more like routines, like we get to perform at third quarter breaks and just that's what our main practices are, the, learning our dances and doing that main routine. And then we'll do the same sidelines as cheer, but mainly like dance technique with it. Well, what's y'all's favorite part about this? Is it the season with the sports or competition or whatever goes on? Game day is just such, I can't explain the feeling of being in the stadium and seeing the whole stadium filled with like the red wave. It's like, I can't explain, like I said, I can't explain the feeling. It's so <laughs> fun uh, being able to show off all the stunts we've been practicing all year round um, and to show everybody what we've been working on. Yeah, hearing everyone too, I don't know if you guys have been to any games, but hearing the Fresno State chant, like, you know, our first time doing it, we were all so nervous, but the turnout and just the crowd, it was amazing. I can't imagine. Yeah. How about you too? Chills. Um, I definitely <laughs> would agree. The Fresno State chant at one of the football games when they first did it was insane because you didn't, like, there's thousands of people around and you wouldn't expect, like, a group of 40 of us to start something like that. So it was really, really fun. Love that. Yeah. How about you? Um, I love going on the field and just dancing my heart out and then yeah. for competitions <laughs> I love going back to my dance roots and doing like contemporary lyrical styles as yes. well. I was going to say for the dance routine or for the competitions what kind of things do you guys do for it like are there sections or how does it all work? Yeah so for dance we'll bring in a choreographer usually from the LA area and they'll come and choreograph for two days for us and then we go compete for in February and we'll just we compete on one day to qualify and then the second day is the finals for them. Wow. And then for cheer we also have a choreographer come in for us. We do have like two sections so we have like a crowd segment. That's where we're like yelling trying to get the crowd involved and then mm. after we get immediately set up and are about to do our team showcasing stunts, jumps, dancing, tumbling, just whole yards. 
That's crazy. <laughs> how, how about the rest of the year? Are there anything else that goes around or anything else with Spirit Fest? Um, so during the year we do cheer at football, volleyball games, and men's and women's basketball and wrestling. She can catch us there. <laughs> yeah, and then yeah. at school they ask us to do a lot of appearances. So we go, some people went this morning to school early and went on their, in their uniforms and just went to an appearance for the students there. Well, thank you so much, ladies, for coming thank and you. spending your afternoon with us. Good luck with the season and competition. I'm sure you guys are going to rock it. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs>